What's going on, everybody? We've got an awesome one on the schedule today. Many months ago, I sent 60 cards off to HGA to get graded, and they have just come back. Uh, these are going to be primarily soccer cards. I think we've got three American football cards in there as well. Uh, now, I did have to look at a few of the cards while I was taking the plastic wraps off. Every card comes back from HGA in, uh, in your typical graded card sleeve. So without further ado, I am going to stop talking and let's check out some of these cards. Starting off with the Prism. Got a rookie of Curtis Jones. And I believe the Bukayo Saka, although it's not, uh, it is not denoted a rookie. It is technically a set rookie. We've got a Curtis Jones breakaway and a Tommy Doyle. Stanford Bridge. Now these cards, you'll notice they are all in order. Uh, now I did not do that. I had uh, my helper, my assistant, got all the cards in order for me of grade and set and thus far did a phenomenal job it looks like. Got a Paul Pogba breakaway to 195. Let's see where this guy ends up. Also, don't mind the bandage on my thumb. I definitely did not cut myself on accident opening the box. Edward Mendy to 159. I think this is the retail red mosaic prism. As you guys are gonna see, I was uh, pretty hot on Edward Mendy for a while. Um, why I was hot on a goalkeeper, don't ask me. I was, uh, was heat of the moment decision. Calvin Phillips, Violet Breakaway. These are two ninety-nine. Got a Curtis Jones Violet Breakaway, also to ninety-nine. And finishing the prism off with a Jared Bowen. This is the forty-nine. This is the teal prism, the teal breakaway. Great season from that fella. All right, moving on to uh, the Merlin. So we've got a Jamal Musiala, nine. Kylian Mbappe, nine. The Manchester City Talisman, Erling Holland. Curtis Jones Refractor. 9.5, another 9.5 on the Curtis Jones Purple. This is to 2.99. Nice, not too many nines. A lot of nine fives so far. Another to 2.99. Got a print line. No, that's the top of the stadium. Benicius to 1.99 in the Aqua. Refractor. That's a sharp looking card. Ooh. Kayo Saka. If I could get these cards separated from each other, that would be great. This is the. Uh, I sent another one of these cards off a few months ago. This is the second 9 5 that we have now in the green mojo. That is to 99. And the true green also to 99. Also with the 9.5. Jury and Timber, Blue Shimmer to 75. That is sharp looking. These labels do look pretty good. 250, Serginio Dest, Gold Atomic, 9.5. How about this one? Bukayo Saka to 50. 9.5, 8 out of 50. And finishing us off on the Merlin is going to be a Rodrigo Goyes to 99 on the Mojo Refractor. This thing got huh, 10 centering. If you say so. Alrighty. 
We've got some chrome, it would appear. Curtis Jones, nine on the aqua refractor. I think this is to 199. I'm a little bit less familiar with the oopsies with the chrome refractors. Killing Mbappe. Pink, I think this is 175. Yep. Mendy here. To 99 with the 9.0 and we've got a Jeremy Doku purple carbon fiber short print 9.5 went with the color blast label I gotta say by and large I am liking take these guys these twins to 2.99 like I said, I was hot on Edward Mendy for a while. Don't ask me why. I couldn't tell you. Killing Mbappe. Aqua Wave to 199. And now we've got a uh, Jurian Timber in there. This is the Steve uh, Aoki Chrome to 99. And a 9.5. Got a Jack Grealish, 9.0. See what that autograph got. Autograph got a 10. All right. Phil Foden, two more. Oh my gosh, these things are airtight. Golly. Two more twins. These are just something weird, I think. To 70 on the fluorescent purple Phil Foden's. We've got a Jack Grealish. The UEFA Euro. 49. I think this is going to be a, a good set coming into the World Cup. We've got a Donnarumma. Pink fluorescent to 10. Cotton candy there. Two. This is three of 10. And finishing it off with another Jack Grealish. This is a 9.5. Nice. And then we've got a stack of a whole bunch of different stuff. So we've got a 9 on the Erling Holland Bundesliga Top's Finest. Got a whole bunch of Erling Holland. Uh, that green, by the way, was to 99. This is the 250 on the purple. 9.5. Got a purple wave. To also to 250. Another purple wave to 250. 9.5. We've got a 9.5 green. To 99. And now we've got a little Serginho Dest. Neon Green Wave. Sharp looking card. Uh, to 99. Another Serginho Dest. This is the Orange Refractor, which happens to look just like the Gold Refractor. This is to 25. Got a Yusufa Mukoko Tops Chrome Refractor. This is the Bundesliga Chrome 2021. Billy Gilmore. Like I said, I sent these things off a few months ago. <laughs> this is 250. Uh, and that is the Stadium Club Chrome Gold Refractor. Jamie Vardy, Gold Power Prism out of Chronicles. 9.0. Great looking card. Got a Curtis Jones Optic Rookie Ticket in the 9.5. Nice. Pretty happy with the grade so far. 9.5 of Connor Gallagher in the Certified Silver Circles. There he is again, making another appearance. 
Edward Mendy, Chronicles Prism Blue, Team Color Match. This is to 49. Nice looking little card. We've got a Ricardo Sotil rated rookie. This is a 23 out of Chronicles. Tony Kroos, number to 10. This is the uh, Illusions Trophy Collection. See down there, number to 10. The Biting Legend, Luis Suarez, Fabric of the Game to 149. Silver Circles. Luka Modric, 9-5. This is a uh, National Treasures Silver Circles. I believe also to, uh, this is just to 49. Wow, beautiful card. And now into the American football, a Tua Tugavailoa Chronicles update, uh, Chronicles Legacy update auto to 99. In the 9-5 with the 10 autograph, nice. A Joshua Kelly, Black Pandora. That is awesome. Look at that. <laughs> it's mesmerizing. I could look at that all day. This is to 25. Got the on card auto there. And finishing us off with a Peyton Manning, Century Stars, Donruss Threads from 2008, number two. Oh, sorry about that low battery. Numbered to 250, and uh, they don't make them like they used to. Personally worn by Peyton Manning in an official NFL game. Alrighty, so let's have a little recap. Let's chat a little bit about HGA. So we've got 60 cards now back from HGA. We're going to talk about the good, the bad, and everything in between, and we are going to start off by having a look at the grading breakdown. So again, we sent 60 cards off, 42 of them are coming back nine fives. We've got 17 nines and then that one lone eight. So let's start off with the positive. What did I like about this HGA submission? I gotta say my first impression of the slabs, you know, they feel good. They are definitely thicker than your average PSA slab. Uh, they just feel, they, I gotta say, they feel like a quality slab. Um, I also do, by and large, like uh, just about all of the labels. I think they do add a nice little pop of color to the card. And I don't think any of them are too loud or overpowering. Alrighty, so we've talked about the good naturally. We've got to move on to the bad now. I will say the uh, turnaround times, I sent these guys, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, sometime in December. And I am now just getting them back in early June. So uh, 60 days has turned into almost six months. I will also say I did notice a few grading inconsistencies. Now we can see, uh, look at the centering on this guy. I'm sure you guys already saw the centering grade, but take a look at that centering for a second. And we see now a 10 on the centering for this guy. Um, definitely undeserved there. We also have a look at that Jack Grealish autograph. We see a 10 there. So definitely some uh, inconsistencies with the grading there to say the least. So, all in all, uh, you know, HGA has its pros and cons, just as any grading service does. was not my intention in making this video to persuade you or dissuade you from submitting with any uh, particular grading company. I just wanted to show off some of these HGA slabs. Uh, so, I thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it as always. And be sure to like and subscribe if you like content like this. We do a lot of uh, random hobby pack openings, grading reveals, product reviews and all that good stuff. So like said, be sure to like and subscribe. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. Take care.